Hello, in this short video, we're gonna walk through a simple but powerful function that maybe isn't as well known as it should be within Inforex ICM. So the function we're gonna be walking through today is the print function, print layout function within Inforex ICM. Uh, it's a great tool to use for simply reporting your modeling results. It's great to hand over to developers uh, so that they have an idea of the area they're working with. You can fit in a lot of details within this uh, print layout. Uh, it's great if you need that, again, hard copy version of your model for communicating what you've been looking at and uh, providing alternatives to traditional kind of GIS uh, reporting methodology again. This is all gonna be within Inforx ICM, uh, but the steps we are going to go through within the tool are again, pretty straightforward here. Uh, we're gonna have a analysis that is already run. So you're gonna simply run your analysis within Inforx ICM. You're going to then open the results uh, you'd like to print uh, in order to use this uh, function. You're gonna lay them out on your geo plan there and in your space. And then from that view, you'll be able to create and customize uh, your different print templates that again, we're gonna see these could be saved for later use actually. So uh, that'll be the last step, saving these templates for later use if you do need to report on this same area of your network over and over again. So now within ICM, the way to go through those steps now is again, first to run your analysis and start to lay that out on your workspace. A great way to do that is through the different workspace tools and options within Inforx ICM. So you could quickly save the graphs and reports and profiles that you want to create within your PDF report, within your printed out report here, uh, drag those onto where you wanna save them and, and then save them for later within a workspace and then use that workspace continuously for future uh, print layouts and templates. So within this example, this is what I want to now show within my report. So I'm gonna come up to file and come to print layout, uh, which is where again, all these different layouts can be saved and you can start to really specify how you want uh, your, your printed reports uh, to be displayed and shown here. So in this case, I'm actually going to open up a different layout here. So I've got uh, multiple templates here and I'm actually going to navigate to this other template that I have saved within this uh, master database here. So I'm gonna to go to my base print template. I can preview that and then start to edit this particular template for, again, printing and, and reporting information on here. So uh, here, down here in the bottom left of my print layout, I've got my different data views. So now I have that grid, that's my worst case uh, flood results that I can drag into this area of my template that I've saved for that particular report. You can see the geo plan is already shown within this template and I've already saved that in here. You can see that here I've added you know, a north arrow. I have a key over here that's associated to that map. Uh, so again, there, if you double click on any of these things, you can see what the association is between uh, some of these different items here. You can add different text uh, boxes here. Uh, you can see in this report, I've actually got two different pages. So I've got this second page where maybe I wanna drag and drop that long section and drag and drop that graph as well that I have in my geo plan. So very easy to start to do that. Uh, you know, again, I could save that template and then I could start to print that out uh, and again to something like a, a PDF here uh, for additional use. So. I'm gonna go ahead and save over that one there and we'll see what that result looks like. So once that print process is complete, you can see what that result might look like once you've laid everything out here. Here you can see within the PDF, I've got my map, my title, uh, I've got a legend in here that of course I could make a little larger if I wanted to in a second run. I've got my grid, my profile, and my graph as well as a little footer I added here. Again, I can certainly take that PDF, print that off. I can print directly from here and go back and forth and, and do further editing if I needed to as well. So within this video, we went through these really quick steps in showing how to easily print and showcase data from Inforx ICM. Uh, simply prepare that data, customize your report, and then be sure to save your template for future use in order to really get the most out of this simple yet very effective tool within Inforx ICM.